Hey guys, welcome to Fur Tutorials. So guys, today I teach you how to create really cool abstract spline animation in Cinema 4D. So firstly guys, I take disk. So go on here and take this one disk and change orientation randomly like this. And guys, I go to display select God shading lines, right? Guys, change segments. Disk segments I take one and rotation segments randomly change like eight, right? But guys, you can take six, six is better, right? This is my corner points. I need this corner points. So increase outer radius like randomly to 50, right? Okay, great. Now guys, I apply vibrator tag on this disk. So go on layer and right click on disk, go to cinema 4D tag and use vibrator, this one. Yeah, and enable position check and enable rotation check. And guys amplitude randomly change like randomly like 500 centimeter, 500 and frequency I take 0 0.5. Yes, and play. Yeah, great. And guys, also change enable rotation. Same randomly, like 180 degree, 360 and 180. And guys, frequency same, 0 0.5. And now I increase frame like 500. And go to back, 0 frame and play. See guys, right? This is my small animation. Yeah, great. Now guys, second step, I apply tracer effect on here, this corner, so stop. Guys, select disk, select, and I go to more graph and use tracer, this one. Yeah, see guys, select tracer and object, tracer link on disk and play right but guys this is not correct so stop so go to limit and use from and and amount i take like 25 and go to back and play yeah see guys that's better right okay so stop guys also change type use this one bezier this is smooth liner and intermediate points i take natural this one and number i take three for less polygon yeah see guys this is my animation right it's really better and it's really smooth also right see its spline is really smooth okay now stop go to back guys this time i take circle and circle radius i take like 15 centimeter and guys you can hide this disk hide and hide on render both dot should be on red and select circle and radius 15 and now i take swap right so guys select this tracer and circle and make child with swap i show you yeah see guys this is my spline abstract spline right okay guys change the shape so guys go to swap and detail and go to first point go to down yes and this is not correct i create some smoothness so i go to caps and start caps check and fill it check 
and guys I go to here step increase increase and radius little bit yes radius I take 8 and step I take 5 right and constraint check see here click on here and go to back and play see guys so stop one second height lines yeah see guys this is my simple abstract spline right okay guys now I apply how to create poly FX effect on this spline so stop so guys this time I take null object select all swap and disk and make child with null right and guys this time take explosion this one select this explosion and drag and drop on null object right so explosion check strength I take like 2 and play yeah see guys this is my poly effects right strength you can change like this right it's lots of polygon yeah that's really cool see okay so stop and guys go to back and play great guys I apply material for better viewing so I go to create and load material this is my material and apply apply this purple on swap yes yeah great right guys also apply light so I go to file and merge select low and background and down guys set light select overhead top box go on mid and little bit down small top box go to back yeah and play right so guys stop render preview see guys this is my poly fx effect right okay now stop guys select this one i create more so select null object and create copy control c and control v and apply change material like this one blue actually yellow right okay guys also change some shape so dig size and outer radius like 200 and circle I take like randomly 10 and play yeah that's better and guys also change this segments this time I take 4 great right guys that's really good okay guys one more so select this null object and again copy and change disk outer radius like 100 and radius rotation segments I take 3 and all is good so this time I take like 12 and guys change material like blue and play see guys that's really cool right so stop I show you you can hide explosion see and play yeah see guys this is my first spline and 
you can open explosion its second viewing right it's really smooth and really good right so select explosion and guys you can change randomly strength speed angle is depend on your work right yeah see now this is my poly effects right okay so stop guys i go to render setting it's take little bit time so i take low render setting mb occlusion and use global illumination select global illumination and indirectly catch a record density i take low and guys anti select only geometry and uh, actually this is save i take jpeg sequences file go to desktop create folder like renders and take any file name and guys output use all actually this my frame size and all yeah that's it guys this is my final render setting so close and render press okay right so guys this is my simple small tutorial is finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download project file from my website is free thank you